Earlier today, the National Disability Commission revealed the data from the survey that was carried out in Region 6 at a forum hosted at the New Amsterdam Special Needs School. More details in this report. In 2016, the National Disability Commission commenced a house-to-house -house survey to gather information on persons living with disabilities in Region 6. Today, a session was held at the New Amsterdam Special Needs School to reveal and discuss the findings of that survey, which concluded in December of 2016. Regional Executive Officer Region 6, Ms. Kim Stephen, attended the session on behalf of the Region 6 Regional Administration. On behalf of the, the Regional Administration, I want to let it be noted that, again, this activity, this presentation of facts can only add value to the persons that are living with disability. I want us to note also today that this was an extensive survey. The survey had commenced on September 26th and concluded on November 30th, 2016. Meanwhile, Mr. Everett Glasgow, Coordinator, National Household Survey for Persons Living with Disability, shared detailed findings from the survey. Extracted from the 21st census, you have the ranking in terms of the regions which are the most populous. You have obviously Region 4, where the capital is, then Region 6 is second, Region 3 is third. However, when we look at persons with disability, the population rank, here, and we take the percentages, we see region 6 would have been ranked third in terms of the region which has the most persons with disability per capita. This is, this is here with respect to the population. 99.8% of those who are interviewed identified as being Guyanese in terms of the gender split. It was almost equal with 51.3% being males and for 8.7% being females. Within region 6, 60.1% of those surveyed were East Indians as related to ethnicity, 29.1% were African descent, and the others would have been small percentages. One individual who was a part of the listening audience thanked the NCD for carrying out the survey while noting its importance. We as persons with disability, we need encouragement, we need motivation, we need persons to show us the kind of affection to make it in life. Because without that, we, we cannot make it, because we need, everyone needs somebody to depend on. The survey and the result, it was very much surprising, because I, for, for myself, I did not know there were so many persons in Region 6 and countrywide who have a disability. I would like to say thanks first to the government for making this possible. Thanks for NCD for being a part of the disabled organization and to be the most stronghold to making this possible. The pilot test for the survey was conducted in Region 6 and other surveys have since been done in regions 5, 3, 2, and 10. Sasha Ramsaran reporting for Channel 8 News.